Hi Heart Flush ladies, um, I thought I'd talk to you today about this new weight loss sensation called the boom bod that's been um, flouted around and I've been advised by a friend that it's really good for the menopausal woman. I'm not doing it for weight loss, um, I'm actually doing it because many of the contents, the vitamins, are what we women, menopausal and women need. For example, B6, um, the, they, it contains B6 which is... Uh, prevents low serotonin. We have, Obviously, we get mood changes in our menopause where we're lacking of a hormone. This stabilizes the B6, stabilizes the serotonin. So um, it's a really good way of getting these vitamins back into our bodies. Um, they come in three little sachets, these tiny little sachets like this. This one's called the Morning Energizer, and it's packed with vitamin C, which is a, obviously a brilliant vitamin for um, this time of year. It keeps the cold and flu and infections at bay so it's a really good thing to actually take and have part of your regular diet um, and what you do you actually get a medium-sized glass and you put a quarter of a glass of water at the bottom and then you pour in the, the, the powder stir for five seconds and you drink it like a shot you would a shot of whatever um, so it's quite good um, the flavour is okay, it's very sweet, that's the only thing I didn't like about it, it was quite sweet. I don't think we need the sweeteners, I don't think we need as much sweetener as we do in all the shots. So that might be one to think about. But they do contain brilliant vitamins, like the morning one contains magnesium, vitamin C, iron, uh, zinc, uh, riboflavin. So these are all really important in our menopausal diet um, and then things that we lack. Um, the next one is the Afternoon Motivator. Now this is this contains B12. Now B12, it's something that helps with our nerves and our blood cells. So we can get it in foods, lots of foods like sardines, beef and tuna. Um, but that's quite a good way to get it into your body. It helps with signs of weakness, tiredness. If you've got light, if you're lightheaded, if you've got shortness of breath, you have pale skin. Uh, tingling in your your limbs, um, you may be B12 deficient, so that's really something that's quite important, especially in the menopausal years. So, this actually gives us some of that back in in the afternoon session. And then what you do is, when you take the glass of um, of, of the shots, when you take them, you actually eat your regular meal afterwards. So you don't have to have any special foods. And then, but what you must do is drink plenty of water after the shots. So it's good to drink water anyway, but keep keep um, keep topped up with water throughout the day. Um, the last one is the the night rejuvenator. Now this contains zinc, manganese, copper, vitamin D. Now D3 is really important with our bones, um, prevents osteoporosis, and it's the best way to actually get vitamin D into our system is to, by taking vitamin D3. So it's a really good supplement to actually take. Uh, selenium, that's also uh, an, another brilliant vitamin that we actually become quite deficient in. And it's good for staying healthy and it's good with your thyroid fun function. Um, it helps to stop infections, but it also importantly helps with depression and anxiety. Now the anxiety was something that actually I noticed in my menopausal time. Um, and I found it quite difficult to cope with. So um, selenium would be a really good way um, of uh, you know, having a supplement to top this up. Brazil nuts, fish, tuna, turkey and beef, they're also actually um, uh, have selenium in. So it's, a, it's an overall great um, vitamin. Um, I, uh, also, there's also biotin, which is brilliant for your hair and for your, for your skin. So in all, they, it's not so much a weight loss program for me, it was more getting the vitamins in, getting the right nutrients in uh, and to see how, it ha you know, how I felt at the end of it. So maybe give it a go and get, get in touch with us on www.hotflushclub.com and if you're using this and you feel good as well or you feel bad or you don't like it, give us your opinions, I'd love to hear from you. Um, as I said, the only thing I didn't quite like about it was the sweetness, so maybe that could be change slightly so give it a go and um hopefully a new year new you speak to you soon